Okay, we are here with Bryce from Omni Security. Uh, Bryce, tell us a little bit about this install. Okay, so um, we kind of got pulled in to put in the access control after the fact. So there wasn't a lot of pre-plan, you know, let's get our wire chases and our runs this way and that way. Uh, we had one door with the install that was going to prove to be quite difficult. Um, so it's down in a parking garage basement. Our control panels are here. So we're using the, the Surefi bridge to be able to alleviate that wire pull. Um, so just as to clarify, so this is going down through a chunk load of concrete below our feet to the parking garage, yes. is that right? Yes, okay. and the door is actually in the concrete wall. Okay, so we'll go down there a little bit in a few minutes and, and take a look at that. So what would you have done had we not had a Surefi unit available? And what, what, what would you have to do to get that down there? Well, I would have had to chase through these condos that were already used. Um, they actually go clear to the other end of the building before they drop through the floor to have to come all the way back along with adding a whole bunch of conduit because it's all concrete and nothing could have so been a whole bunch of conduit work. So ballpark, how much time and, or money would, would that have cost you? You know, probably a thousand bucks in two days. It would have been wow. two, day, two extra days and just getting our wires to the location we needed to be. Yeah, That's a huge saving. All right, well, let's head downstairs. Is that tell, us, right? tell us what's going on down here. So as you can see, we came down a level, um, concrete everywhere. Yeah, there is not a good way here, is there? You know, there's already a conduit to do everything else electrically down here because nothing was, I mean, just kind of didn't have the thought to do beforehand. So here's the door I needed to get to. So what we went ahead and done, I can't even reach it all. So the other end of the Surefire remote is actually inside. We mounted inside this can, you know, to kind of give it more snags of. Yeah, and is that a metal box? Yes. Yeah, so going through not only all the concrete, but also a metal enclosure. Good. Anyway, so that was able to get us there. So now the only wires I needed to run were from here to the door unit. And it's just got a mag lock right there, right? Yes. Okay, excellent interior door application. All right, so you've installed quite a few certified units, at least a few, right? Uh, what is your impression? I like it. It's simple to use. Simple to use and cost effective. And I mean, this was a huge problem. I'm going, what am I doing? Not a problem anymore. Awesome. Hey, Bryce, thank you so much. Yep.